These text boxes are EVP captions from EVPs that I hear later while editing. I'm not sure you're going to be able to hear the EVPs in this one, even with headphones. They're mostly faint whispers, and to play them for you, I'd just have to turn up the volume. And there's too much crying and sniffling, so that won't work. This one's tough. I'm not sure how to edit this. Yeah. I can't. I can't tune in without, without crying, without crying hard. This is what it can be like to be empathic or clairsentient. I'm here at the internment camp at Topaz in Utah. And yeah, it's an internment camp but some of the official signs called it a relocation center. So, I don't know. But I, uh, I had to pee, so I went over by this bush and there was this giant spider. I heard in my head somebody calling it a widow maker. So I'm gonna go take a picture of that. In December 1941, Japan attacked Pearl Harbor. Afterwards, in February 1942, 120,000 Americans of Japanese descent were considered a threat to the U.S. and kicked out of their homes. 11,000 of them ended up at Topaz. I don't even want to do this place. I guess I do. I'm just saddened by it. So I guess I'm going to go in there and look around. <sighs> this footage is from the 1945 documentary film Topaz, shot illegally by internee Dave Tatsuno. In 1990, Tatsuno talked about his films. He stressed that they were home movies focused on friends and family and not intended to document life at Topaz. They were taken secretly, so we had to avoid shots of anything controversial, like guard towers, barbed wire, etc. He said, the camera shots thus do not fathom the emotions hidden within the evacuees. The fear, the loneliness, the despair, and bitterness we felt. I just can't, I can't. <laughs> I don't know what the. The climate was extreme, ranging from averages below freezing in the winter to mid-90s in the summer. And when the internees got there, the buildings were unfinished and empty, with no furniture. Eventually their barracks were heated with pot-bellied stoves, but they had to make furniture from scraps found around the camp. They were given a loyalty questionnaire asking if they'd be willing to serve combat duty in the armed forces, wherever ordered. What would your answer be if your life was disrupted and your family imprisoned by your own country? Yet the 100th and 442nd Infantry Battalions, both comprised of Japanese Americans, went to war to fight for America and saw heavy action. It's just a massive area with probably a bunch of foundations just like the one I'm sitting on. People treating people like they're treating people. It's not okay. Oh, I don't know what I'll keep and what I'll edit out. I don't, I don't know what I can do with this. Yeah, I keep crying as soon as I tune in. 
And I don't know why, I don't know, I don't know what the, what it is. I've been in horrible, horrible places where terrible things have happened and I'm usually okay. This is not okay. And I mean, it doesn't have this energy or anything. It's not like terrible things are happening right now in here. I don't want any spirits here. I want everybody to be gone. I hear spirits talking, talking about me and saying like, oh, he's a sweet boy, um, that I'm being so considerate. This one's gonna work. <laughs> yeah. I can't, I can't tune in without, without crying, like crying hard. I don't know what the deal is. I don't know if it's what's happening now or if it's the spirits here or the feelings I'm feeling from, from here or, ah, oh, I can't, I can't tune in and be able to do this. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna try to ground. <sighs> yeah, I can't, I can't tune in without, without losing it. I mean, seriously, I don't get it. I don't know what's happening. I mean, I've been, I've been overwhelmed by, um, by spirit and connecting, but this is crazy. I can hardly talk. I can hardly get this out. Man, these people were resilient. I get a sense of, um, once they were able to accept what was happening, they just owned it. And they made this into like their own little town. They made it work. And then uh, I know I'm getting support from the other side. Well, if you guys didn't know, I'm a psychic medium. <laughs> I like to film and film my interactions with you guys. And if you're unsure about having permission to interact with me, which doesn't seem like you're too concerned with that, but if, you have, if you're unsure about being on camera or being on the audio recording, uh, please talk to my guides and follow their instructions. Please don't use any names. And, uh, yeah. You want to tell me about, tell me about what life was like here? It was hard. They made it. Okay, let's see. Let's see if I can uh, keep it together. Keep it together, keep it together, keep it together. It's a gatehouse. Yeah, I'm unable to uh, tune in and, and get anything. I think I'm walking towards there. Well, I don't know what I'm walking towards. I need to also watch out for snakes and stuff. And those giant frickin' spiders. Jeez. Some sort of guard, guard area. What is this? this I don't know what this is I appreciate the respect 
that this place is getting with an American flag and talking about all of the all of the internment kids who went off to fight in the war for America. There are no signs. There's nothing telling what this this place is. I wonder if that's outside of the the fort. I'll keep walking around. I think all we can get are EVPs with this one because I'm not able to uh, tune in really. Do you guys want to show me? Show me where to go? I feel like I'm being told the cafeteria or the uh, school. Yeah, little pieces of little bolts. Can you guys show me something really cool? I mean, show me something Japanese. I wanna see something Japanese. It's like, ah, oh, okay. It keeps going. Oh, I think I'm seeing another jackrabbit. Big, big one. Oops. All right, I gotta stop this. It's funny, it shut off. Thank you for having me. Thank you for letting me feel something and um, talk to my team. Please move on. God bless you. I'd like to hear about your experiences with being psychically overwhelmed. And be sure to check out my other paranormal and psychic videos. And if you want to help me out, please subscribe. And thanks for watching.